Hi guys, Jason here and welcome back to another episode of my FIFA 17 Scaling Road to Glory. So starting off this video, the first thing I do go and do is change my two kits. So as the home kit, I choose the Atlanta Spore kit from the Turkish League. And then for my away kit, I go and get the Chavez kit there from the Liga Nos. And this was actually recommended by Adrian Nielsen. And later on in the video, you will also see me change my badge to the New York Red Bull badge. But if maybe you want a different badge, tell me in the comment section below and I will be definitely change it. So after changing my kits, I decided to get into the first match of the day, of the day and we go um, with our Syria or Kelsey away team. So this guy's called Fatty FC, it's pretty funny. Um, so yeah, we go with our away kit there. He goes with his home kit. The kits look pretty similar, but they're actually alright in game. So we're getting into this guy's team now. He had Inform Immobile, Immobile um, Parejo, Draxler... Edison Cofani and a few other good players. So starting off here, we take a corner and then it goes straight to Al Sharari. He does a really, really nice volley past the goalkeeper. And luckily for us, the defender on the line is, isn't able to get it. Then later on here, our opponent gets it, runs through with a mobile, goes and takes the shot. I thought that went in, but it just goes marginally wide of the post. And then later on here, we get it with Condrado, take a shot, and then luckily for us, it hits the crossbar. We get the ball there, crossing with Al Sharari. Take one shot with Asamoa, the ball rebounds back, and then we go and tap in the finish there. So as you can see, here's a nice replay. Goldie saves the first shot, and then Asamoa is able to finish the second chance. Now again, in the 6-9th minute here, we get the ball. Play it there to Matias Fernandez. Do a nice fake Rabana to a few skill moves. I think it's called the quick drag backs. And then we get it here on the edge of the box. Do a nice Balassi flick. The game was slightly laggy. We go and take the shot, and again, it just goes slightly wide of the post. And then we were basically just dominating this whole match, as you can see from the chances. We get a chance here with Quadrado. Do a really nice gun with that to a Magidi spin. Do a nice heel to heel there. Then we do a nice roulette there. Get it at the edge of the box here. Go for the Balassi flick. Take the volley. And unluckily, it goes and hits the post. So in that match, Asamoa managed to get man of the match. We win the match 2 0. Probably could have won it 3 or 4 0. But I was just trying to get good skill goals. And then we're going to get ourselves some nice coins. And we now have 9 points in Division 8. So we're getting closer and closer to the Division um, 8 title. Then after this, as I uh, said previously, we go and change our badge from that one. What we actually think we got in a bronze pack to the New York Red Bull badge. And then we go straight into our next match here against Skrillex FC. We actually go with our home kit this time, the red one from Atlanta Sport. He's a Southampton fan, as you can tell from his badge and his kit, and especially some of the players he has in his team, such as one to watch Gabbiadini, Inform Tadic, and Bufal, the five-star skiller. So again, we get the first chance here in the game. Really nice skill moves there with um, Inform Benega. We get, we get lucky there for the ball to bounce back to us from his um, defender tackling us. And then we go run through on goal and take the finesse shot with Benega. And we are 1-0 up very early on in this match. Then later on again we get it here with Niang. Do some nice skill moves. Do a double spin. And then manage to go with the low driven shot past the goalkeeper into the bottom right corner. So here's a nice replay. There's the double spin. And we smash it into the corner. That's a great finish from Niang. Then in the next chance here we do some really good skill moves with Quadrado. Um... We turn around, do a nice double touch spin, to a ball off flick, to a heel to heel, to again, we go for the pirate skill move, and luckily we get tackled, but then Benega picks up the ball and takes a brilliant long shot past his goalkeeper Begovic, and it goes into the top left corner, and it's just an unstoppable shot, and I'm actually very impressed with Benega, before using his inform card on loan, I've never used him this year, and I'm definitely um, going to pick him up after his loan expires, probably just his normal card though, because we can't afford his inform card at the moment. Uh, sorry if you can hear my dog barking in the background as well. So yeah, we win this match. Well, we, it's 3-0 at half time and then this guy decides to rage quit. Um, so yeah, we get a nice 3-0 win there and we get 367 coins. And that means we do now have 12 points in Division 8. Um, one winning out away and out from promotion. We go with our BPL team this match or our hybrid team with Aguero, Balassi, Carrillo and then the sweaty MLS defence. So this guy is just called United. We go with our red kit. He goes with that blue kit there. And then we get straight into this match after he makes a few changes, I think. Um, yeah, anyway here. So getting into his team now. He had a w weird team. We seem to come against these weird teams in Division um, you know, 8 and 9. Just because people haven't exactly got enough coins yet to build a full chemistry squad. So early on here, we get a free kick. Play it short by Pizzi to the um, Pereira. And then Pereira is there to get a nice finesse shot past the goalkeeper. Even though he only has 66 shooting, it feels much better in-game. 
Then later on here, we get it with um, Carrillo. Do a really nice skill move there. Um, do a nice drag back there. Go and take the long shot, and his goalie just manages to hit it wide of the post. And then again, later on in the match here, we get it with Carrillo. Do a nice ball roll to Hocus Pocus. Pass the two defenders there. Do the pipe skill move. Go for a nice spin there. Then we do a nice heel to heel to beat the last defender, run through on goal and do a really nice finesse shot around the goalkeeper. And that's probably the best goal we've scored so far in this series. And I'm thinking of maybe making like a Hall of Fame where we put our best goals. So then at the end of this series, I can show the best goals we've scored. So later on here in the match, we do a nice hocus pocus pass there by Aguero, play to Lanzini and he finishes it off. So we go and win that match for now we get 599 coins. And then we go in advance, and as you can see now, we've actually got promotion um, into Division 7, I think it is. And then after this, I decide to go and do some SBC player upgrades. I haven't actually done any of these yet. So in the first pack, I go and open it, and we go and get this 74 rated silver, who actually looks pretty decent. 89 pace and 80 dribbling. He's from the Turkish League as well, so that's pretty handy if we do want to do the Samuel Eto SBC. And then again, all of these players they actually submit are untradeable, so we didn't actually spend any money or use any of our bronze players we've packed. And also, if you're wondering why my coin balance goes up and down in this video, as I said, I'm not showing me opening the bronze packs anymore. So yeah, if my coin balance is going up and down, that's the reason why. So guys, again, we do it one more time here to get our third pack. I'll be doing this as well in the next video, um, just to get a few more silver players into our club, and maybe we can pack one of those inform or man of the match cards. So on our last pack there, we don't really get anything good. Um, we get, I think it's again a Turkish league goalkeeper and that French player there from, I think it's the second league in French. So anyway guys, this is going to be the end of the video. If you have enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Can we try and smash 20 likes on this video by tomorrow? Anyway, thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.